Hello again, everybody, and welcome back to Let's Play Mega Man X4, Part 2. Alright, here we go again. Last time, we defeated Jet Stingray and Web Spider. So for now, we're going to defeat Split Mushroom. That's how I recall. He occupies the laboratory and will attack whoever visits there. Now we're heading to the bio lab. Oh look. Stairs of Doom. Okay, watch out for these kite like enemies. Those shields are friggin' annoying. Shooting the shooting them in the back is the only way to kill them. Ouch. Bats. Oh man. They look like sting stingrays. Alright. Oh. Well, not these things again. Man, are these enemies that annoying? Bottomless pits can kill you instantly. Watch out. Is that a ladybug like Reploid or Maverick? I think it's a Maverick. Oh, great. Flower enemies. Annoying. Crap, don't touch me, stupid robots. Okay. Should probably, should probably watch out. I should probably kill these enemies. So I can proceed, right? Ow. Stop rushing. Sorry about that. Yes, watch out for instant death spikes. Those, those thorns, they count as spikes, instant death. And these drill-like traps are annoying. You can't kill those things. You can't even kill them. That doesn't even make any sense. You can't kill these things. And they even go through? Come on. You can also jump on webs. How cool is that? I would I would save it. Save that weapon energy if I were you, X. Okay. Wow. Biolab. Kind of reminding me of the Resident Evil franchise when there's a a bioweapon lab. We've got an enemy. Friggin' annoying. Yes, and the spikes could kill you instantly. Oh man. Am I going on the wrong platform? Oh, the spikes are disintegrated, and all the platforms are disintegrated as well. Oh, another staircase of doom. Another stairs of doom. And bouncing enemies so annoying get away from me they remind me of the wheelies from Mega Man X1 but they're different and these rays up there whatever they are they're friggin annoying get away from me oh man these over there could kill you instantly those kites that carry a big spike, two spikes, they could kill you. Oh, great. Gotta get that art tank. There we go. Yeah, you can't kill those things. I'd move fast if I was you, X. What are you doing? There we go. There we go. Oh, great. Elevator of Doom. Ouch. Stupid 
bombs to shoot spike bombs at you. Come on. Ouch. Oh. Yeah, crashing into those things could kill you instantly. Let's fill up our health. Now we got a boss battle. Split mushroom. He's crazy. Are you X? I'm under orders to terminate you. What? Whose orders? Take a wild guess. Sigma. It's probably Sigma. Yeah, he's gonna jump around. When he's on the wall, he's going to use a clone of himself, which is kind of annoying. His weakness is lightning web. Gotta fry him. And he gets electrocuted. And he falls out of the wall. And then he jumps onto another wall, then shoot him. Keep going. I want to see what he does. Right. Come on. He then he creates a two a lot of forces of himself, and he and then we beat him. Take that. And take this and that, you stupid reploid mushroom. You've gone totally maverick. And we beat the stage. What do we get? Soul body. He's all orange. Accumulates energy and generates an illusion. Enemies will sustain damage if struck by the soul energy. Requires high energy expenditures, however, and will eventually dissipate in time or it will sustain heavy damage. What's next? Let's go see Cyber Peacock. Yeah. It's gotta be the most annoying level of the game. He lives in cyberspace and he wants to destroy the network system. Yeah, if I try to do it in zero, it'll be a pain. I bet it's gonna be a bitch to beat the record of getting S ranks. So I suggest using Split Mushroom from now on. Watch out for these things. They'll slow you down like crazy. Come on. Move it. Ta-da. S rank. You get the heart tank. In the sub tank, you've got to get an S rank. If you get a B rank, you have to start again. You have to get an S or A to, so that you can proceed. I recommend doing an S rank. Come on, move faster than the speed of light. Hooray, S rank. All right. Gonna do the third one, which is gonna it's gonna be totally annoying. Come on, move like crazy. Okay, do not run into these things. Crap. Move it. Move like you mean it, man. You really do. Come on. Move it. Yes! Thank you! 
If you get touch by one of these yellow things, they'll slow you down. And look, you get a doctor-like capsule. I'm giving you a new head module X. This module will improve your special weapon abilities. It should reduce your special weapon energy requirements to near zero. You may now use your special weapons as often as you want. Well, this is going to be interesting. The helmet. Looks freaking awesome. Right now there. Oh great. It's, it's ruining my frame rate. Go away. What are you doing? Oh great. Traps over there. And some more spike balls again. Oh great. Wow. It's going to be really annoying. Cyber Peacock's weakness is Soul Body. His potential is limitless? Not possible. Who are you? Why are you doing this to me? I was ordered to test your abilities. It's quite simple. What? Prepare yourself. Wow. He's going to teleport. And he's going to be totally annoying. You gotta use your soul body to attack him. Watch out for his feathers, tail feathers. He will fly up, then he will disappear. Keep it up. Alright, let's try to use Groundhog to finish him off. Oh, never mind. I had no choice. Soul body, finish him off. Because that's his weakness. I need to do the right thing. I did. I got an aiming laser. He's purple and and cyan. Move the cursor to lock on the enemies. Attack with the enemies with the attack attacks the enemies with the aiming laser. Let's continue. Sir, it is a message from the Colonel X. I'll wait for you at the memorial hall. Make sure you show up on time. Sir, this must be a trap. Perhaps, but I won't run this time. Yeah, we're going to face the colonel. Colonel, stop this foolishness now. Never. Colonel, please think this over. The Repla Force must be independent. Our battle will determine this. Yeah, he's going to be very annoying. He's going to use his lightsaber, that red one, to slash you. So he will block your blasts. Oh man. This battle is really going to be, be insane. Great. It's not like I even care. Get away. Watch the pattern. Ow! Go away. Stop blocking your sword. You crazy punk. Oh man. He keeps disappearing and he keeps striking his sword at me. 
I don't know why he keeps his speed. His speed. He's just like agile. Totally fast. Well, not exactly like agile. Come on. Take that, Colonel. Impressive, but the result won't be the same until next time. Until then. Colonel! Then he just disappears. If you defeat four Mavericks, you'll face Colonel. Let's go into the Air Force. Storm Owl. I think he's related to Storm Eagle. He left with a space fortress to conquer the air. Oh wow, kind of reminds me of that egg carrier from Sonic the from Sonic Venture Director's Cut and Sonic Heroes. Those blue airships are friggin' annoying. They shoot homing missiles at you. Oh look, a ride armor. It can let you fly. That's nice. Come on. Come on. If I was a Reploid, I don't know what I would do. What would you do if you were a Reploid? I don't know. Have peace? Okay, get that health capsule. Come on, get in the stupid ride armor. There we go. There we go. Oh, great. Little mecha walkers. Oh, I don't know what these things are. They're kind of, they're very annoying. Yeah. Oh, go away. Oh, I got, oh no. Miss the heart tank. Oh man. I can't I can't instantly die. That makes no sense. Okay, never mind, I'll get that later. Forget it, I'll get it later. You know what? Just forget it. I'll get it later. Just get these annoying robots out of my friggin' way. Why do they put you back there? That's crazy. Hmm. Okay, should have moved faster, X. Let's forget about those. We'll get the hard tank later, right after I beat Storm Owl. Okay, should probably use Cyber Peacock. Should probably use Aiming Laser. No, gotta destroy that that thing that blocks. I mean, we got big laser enemies and spikes. Did those things kill you instantly? Oh man! Not only do these things kill you instantly, they hurt. Come on! What are you doing? Don't touch the spikes! What are you doing? Grass kick decks? I'm not. Oh, look. Capsule upgrade. You can charge up to four blasts at a time with this arm module. It takes a while to charge, but you can fire a charge shot at any time you so wish with it. This arm module is also changeable. Enter this capsule to change parts. Oh, man. You know what? I could probably go 
with the second one. With this arm part, you can fire the plasma shot, which is effective against stronger enemies. If the shot hits the opponent, plasma is generated, which will cause a additional damage to the enemy. This arm module is changeable, and it is capsule to change parts. I think I'd rather use this from now on. I like this one better. Oh, come on. Nope. Come on. I'm not going over there. Whoa! Stupid punk ass enemy. Oh man, I'm running out of health. Oh no. No, no. I don't want to run out of health. Oh man, I'm about to die. Oh man, if I take one more hit on those spikes, I'm dead. I'm toast. Okay, we got a mini boss. Gotta shoot down that red, red thing. You know what? I should probably fill up my health. Because I'm running out of health. What do I care? These just, they're just annoying enemies. They're totally annoying, seriously. And plus, I don't even know or what to say. I don't even know what to say. These things are annoying. Well, I beamed them. I beat him. And look. A full health capsule. How nice. Okay. And here we are, folks. Storm Owl. How dare you destroy my unit! You'll pay for this with your life! Man, he's gonna be a real annoyance. Oh, come on! You gotta start shooting, blasting him. Come on, blast him! You gotta blast him with your lasers, that's his weakness! Oh, come on, he grabs you and he, and he pushes you to the ground! Gotta use your homing missile. Use your aiming laser to, to to defeat him. Come on. Keep going, X. Watch out. He's gonna use three tornadoes at you to damage you. I mean, what is that green aura? Take that. You're finally finished, bro. Ching. What do we get? Double Cyclone. The way this weapon will help defeat Magma Dragoon, the traitor, fires vacuum cyclones left and right. Most effective when surrounded by the enemies and against skyborne enemies. Cool. Oh, cool, cool. Okay. I'm going to go back for now. Probably get that health upgrade. Oh, come out! Oh, he's green and yellow. At least you're not Steam Chameleon. You don't have Steam Chameleon's weapon. Come on, blast this son of a bitch up! So annoying. Get lost. Go away. Yes. I needed that. You should always move fast, X. Hmm. Well then, let's head to the volcano. Here we go. To face 
Magma Dragoon. He betrayed the irregular hunters and hid himself inside a volcano. Good grief. Good grief, man. Ready? Go. Okay. There's going to be some metal, some lava rocks coming from behind. It's not going to be, be fun. It's going to be totally annoying. Yeah, some of them come out of the come out of the sky to block you from jumping. Let's see a charged shot of of twin cyclone. Cool. Double cyclone I mean. And ground hunter. Let's see a, a fully charged up version of this. Let's use Soul Body, fully charged. Whoa, it creates a clone of X. And Lightning Web. Creates, like, a lot of webs. Whoa, that hurts. Go away, stupid bats. And the metals, the metals again. I recognize them from Mega Man X1. Watch out for fire coming out of the ground. Uh oh. More fire rocks coming forward to attack you. Come on, destroy that door. So we can proceed. Great. Those fireballs can destroy your footing. Right? Well, wow, we got some big robot guys over there with green hats. Kind of remind me of M. Bison from Street Fighter, doesn't he? Come on, get away from these punk ass fireball. Oh, we get the, the heart tank. All right, lightning web is required, so that's fine. Get away from me. Come on. Stop wasting your health and watch out for these. Rockets, and look, a mecha, and there's lava, instant death lava. Should probably use a charged shot. Should probably use ground hunter. No, the only thing I need was Twin Slasher. Right? I'll get to that later. To get that Dr. Light capsule. The lava will kill you instantly. Be careful. I would suggest you be careful, X. And... The heck is that up there? Oh, great. Is this where we're going to be fighting Magma Dragoon? Yep. Here he is, folks. Magma Dragoon. X, you've arrived. Dragoon, why did you betray the HQ? Huh, you have to defeat me first. But we're allies. You're so naive. 
Listen closely. I let the Sky Lagoon fall, and I do it again. <laughs> no, those were innocent people. You're not Dragoon, just a maverick. You got that right. Power up, X. It's time you show me what you can do. Wow, he must have been taken over by Sigma. And he's going to do the Shoryuken and the Hadouken attack, which can be annoying. And then he shoots fire at you. Wow, he's doing a Street Fighter move. As if he's Ryu or Ryu. Well, it's pretty cool. Now, let's try using Double Cyclone. Should probably get out of there. Try this on for size, Dragoon. Now jump back in and kick his ass. Ha ha, serves you right, Dragoon. You are strong, X. Such a waste. Why, Dragoon? Always wanted to fight you. Then he appeared and... He appeared? Who? He told me to work for Rapper Force to goad you into fighting. You did it just so you could fight me? It was worth it for a final duel. Dragoon! It's Sigma who brainwashed him. Then he explodes. We get Rising Fire. Shoots fire energy vertically, effective against all airborne bad guys. Some objects may be burned by this attack as well. I'll go to the jungle and get that, that heart tank. Okay. Rising fire shoots fireballs upward. And then you do the fire version of the Shoryuken when you fully charge your ex with your cannon. I don't know. At least you're not Ryu from Street Fighters. Yeah, watch out for these. Watch out for the deep sea enemy guys. Kind of like the Deep Sea King. The dude from One Punch Man. He is very messed up. Well, he's one of my favorite villains from One Punch Man. Come on, don't fall. Oh, yeah. Get lost. There we go. Now into the jungle area number two. <sighs> Gotta get that heart tank and stupid snakes piss me off. Those mega hives, that's what they're called. These enemies are called mega hives. Out of my way, stupid bees. I don't have time for this. Just give me some health. Ah, fire really does burn away wood. Cool. Oh man, this is going to be a 
annoying. Whoa! Got the heart tank. Thank you. Now let's get out of here. I'll go to snow base and I'll get the tank. No. Oh. And I'll defeat that walrus. Frost walrus. He protects the secret weapon which lies inside the snow. The snowfall. The snow base. And hey, look. Hey, look. It's Blizzard Buffalo. What the heck? It's, it is him! Blizzard Buffalo from X3! And watch out for these little snowman enemies. They're freaking annoying! And we get the life! And are those abominable snowman looking things? They shoot snowballs at you, which can be totally annoying. And icicles are on the ground as of the shock wave. Yeah, the ice disappears. Oh, man. Gotta use that thing. That rising fire to destroy that ice so that we can get the heart tank. Okay, hurry up. Kind of reminds you of the Freeze Man stages from Mega Man X7. Watch out for spikes. They annihilate you. Watch out for these skiing enemies. They're freaking annoying. Whoa. Okay, try this again. No, come on. Ta da. Get away from me. Oh, if they push you onto the, to the ceiling, you die instantly. Watch out. Great, we got a mini boss. And look who we have here. Is that Joe Penguin? He's from X1. I remember fighting Joe Penguin in the first game crud take that rising fire is the only way to kill that enemy Ice cubes and metars. Oh. Away. 
Okay. Weapon tank. W tanks. Or whatever they are. Oh, not these enemies over there. Pain in the ass. They freeze everything up. Wow. They look like birds. And icicles. On the ceiling. And the floor is slippery. Gotta destroy it before he freezes everything up. Come on! There we go! Oh, come on. He also freezes the metars. The metals. Can't believe he turned the metals into popsicle. We're gonna beat Frost Wallace by kicking his ass. They sent a kid like you after me? I promised to end this quickly. Rising fire is his weakness. When he gets hit by it, he will crawl down. It's, it's kind of annoying. And he freezes everything up. Into a big uh, icicle. And he's immune to the soul body. And he shoots icicles out of his shoulders. And yes. Serves you right. Whoosh. Frost Tower. Probably go to the military train. And face Slash Beast. He defends the military train to protect the supply of goods. He's kind of remind me of Leomon from Digimon. Well, watch out for these. Watch out for the trains that blow up. What are those metal things? When I use Frost Tower fully charged, oh, well, it creates this big icicles. Alright, now I got a mini boss. Three spikes over there, which can be annoying. Come on, you gotta shoot that thing. Come on. Come on. All right. Hope that's everything.
Gotta destroy some crates. Use that battle armor, that right armor, to destroy that orange thing. Cause that orange thing looks rusted. Get away from me. Stop shooting me. There's gotta be a heart tank over there. No. Come on, get out of my way. Okay, the train stops. Get away from me. These bats are shooting torpedoes at you. Here we go again. Now we're gonna face Slash Beast. Cause after we face him, we'll end the stream. Man, he's running fast like Sonic. Challenging my unit was both foolish and reckless. You are nothing more than my prey, one that is soon to be retired. Yeah, Ground Hunter is his weakness. And he's gonna slash you and He's going to jump on the wall to attack you. Man, he, he jumps up. And then I finished him off. Whoosh. Got Twin Slasher. Shoots Twin Slashers forward in two directions. This weapon has wide range capabilities, making it easier to hit enemies. The Rapid Force has begun assembling. Where are they? The spaceport. They plan to take off into space. Hurry, we have to stop the Colonel. Okay. Right. 
before I end it, I think I should probably get the last part. But then again... Maybe not, I don't know. You know what, never mind. I think I'll, I'm gonna end this stream for now. Okay, everybody, this is Gabriel Gaming 5000K. I'm going to be signing off, and I will see you in the next video. And I'll get the last, I'll get the last upgrade. So take care, everybody.